Hey, Happy New Year's everybody. I hope everybody had a great uh, holiday season, but you know, it's Friday again and it's back to work on January 2nd. Now, you might or might not know, but the iPhone has been successfully unlocked. The iPhone 3G has been successfully unlocked about a week or two ago and they, the iPhone dev team have finally released a beta version of their iPhone 3G unlock and I'm going to demonstrate that for you today. How to unlock your iPhone 3G so that you can use it with any carrier, not just AT&T if you're here in the United States. As you can see, this is my iPhone. It has the AT&T SIM card in it right now. What you need before you start is you need to make sure these are the two you know, accessories that you would need. This little you know, SIM card jimmy that came with the iPhone and of course your other SIM card. In my, my example is the T-Mobile. So before you start, I want you guys to make sure that your phone has all the software up to date because this unlock only works with firmware version 2.2, which is kind of weird because originally the team had, you know, uh, warned everybody not to upgrade to 2.2 if they want to unlock. Go to General. Now, for T-Mobile, you will have to have your 3G turned off because T-Mobile's 3G service actually operates on a different frequency, so that can create some problems. Oh, also turn off location services. If it's on, turn it off. Then go to Network, Enable 3G, turn that off. As you can see, I am on a Wi-Fi network and I recommend everybody do this. Get on a Wi-Fi network. So next, you take your little Jimmy tool at the top of the iPhone, right here, you'll see that little hole, just stick it in and you'll see the SIM card will pop out. So take it out, replace it with the AT&T SIM card, put it back in, ignore all the little warning messages because they won't matter soon. All right, now go to Cydia. Oh, you will have to have your phone jailbroken for this process to work also. So if, you, if your phone isn't jailbroken, you go online, go on YouTube, search jailbreak, iPhone 3G jailbreak review, and you'll find a million different you know, seven-year-olds teaching you how to jailbreak it. And they're, in a lot of cases, they're more eloquent than I am. So get your phone jailbroken, jailbroken beforehand. Go to Cydia. All right. And then go to Manage. Now you'll see that my phone already recognizes it because I already unlocked it beforehand to make sure it works for all you guys before, you know, blindly putting out a tutorial out there. Go to sources, but normally if, okay, if you put in your SIM card right now, it'll probably just be blank over here. So don't be worried if it doesn't look exactly like mine, okay? Now your sources, you have to actually add a source. I've already added it right here, but if you don't know how to add a source, click edit, add and then enter the source right here. The source for Cydia is APT9 dot yellow and that's snow with a zero dot com Okay, and then you click add source. I'm going to click cancel because I already have the source added. As you can see, it'll show up right there. Alright, make sure that's a zero, not, a, not an O. So, after you've done that, click done. Alright, go to search. Search yellow. Just 
search that, then go all the way down to Y, and you'll see Yellow Snow is probably going to be the last uh, app up there. So hit Yellow Snow once again. It'll ask you. It'll be a little different here because it'll ask you to install, whereas I already have it installed. So I'm going to click Modify and reinstall. Confirm, and you'll see this little screen pop up. There's my AT&T SIM card. Okay, so now it's complete. 